Kelsey said it couldn't boot. I say I'm giving her the boot. She's fired. The true test. Here we have Geo Party. If you guys can answer one question. Ah, it shocked me, you fuck. In a, in a game of Geo Party. This is an officially semi-working Sega CDX whatever. Oh wait, I think it started up this Genesis game. The trick is to turn it on without the Genesis game. Oh yeah, look at that. It wants to start now. Okay, go. You uh, see this one won't even turn on. Just kidding. So there you go, you can test the uh, speaker. Here, now hold on. This is how cool I am. Look at this. See this? I always like pointing this out. It's probably not interesting to anyone else, but I think it's very funny. So here's the battery for the Wii U Pro Controller. Here's the battery for the regular 3DS. You notice any similarities? The Pro Controller uses the same battery as a device that has two screens with sound and light and internet capabilities. That's why the Wii U Pro Controller lasts forever. A kid took it camping? Why would you take a 64 camping? I love my 64 too, but... Expansion pack looks good. Whoa! Oh my god! This is next level. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, you guys ready? <laughs> Okay, so Oh my god. I often say I've never seen a bug infestation in a system before, but this this changes things. Everybody who's uh who has ears should probably not listen to this. Here it comes, folks. Ah! All right. Sorry about that. Dr. Kirby, would you assist me? Sure thing, Big Papa Codester. All right, Dr. Kirby. Let's uh, let's try to do an experiment to see how we could have replicated uh, a 64 controller being used as a possible weapon. Are you ready, Dr. Kirby? Now, if he threw it directly at the target, it would have bounced off very nice and cleanly like it just did. 
and Dr. Kirby still would have lived. The only way I could think is if you bashed his head in like this, like you hold it, it's got a nice grip to it, and some of the blood could have gone inside of here, and then I think the 64 controller could be a murder weapon if you tried hard enough. What? Huh. This is actually an incredibly awesome, awesomely built controller. Wow. Huh. That's amazing. Alright, so what I'm going to do is get just a little bit of alcohol in there, blow it out. Uh, I'll probably do that like two or three times, press the button a bunch, just to make sure it's really cleaned out. Um, but yeah, look at this thing. That is, that is amazing. The solder joints all look awesome. Looks more solid than the crappy Joy-Cons. Oh, for sure. Oh yeah, by the way, I ordered a uh, hundred replacement Joy-Cons. This is the last save battery I have here. What the hell? Open and but up up up. Uh. Ah, ah, oh, fuck! 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 Ah! Fuck! Ah! Hold up. You know what? I'm not giving up on this 64. I think I can fix it. Whoa! Oh crap! My tripod broke. Ah, so annoying. All this stuff's breaking all the time. <sighs> Hold on, let me just adjust this. Adjust that. Just a little bit more adjusting. I think I almost fixed it. Oh, there it is. Oh, I see. It was just kind of loose. All right, let's go ahead and try just one more time. The one thing I've always thought, uh, the one trick that I've always done to fix video games is to blow on them. It's, uh, it's an old trick I picked up as a kid, something I've been trying to teach people about, but no one seems to know about it. Oh ho! What did I say? The old Cody trick did it again, folks. Uh, I haven't really messed too much with um, Slim PS2s. Oh, is it working now? Oh. What would cause it to suddenly decide it wanted to work? Where's the excess water go? That's a really good question. That's a really, really good question. It's an extremely concerning question. Oh God. Where the hell does the dirty water go? I can hear it. Yeah, gotta get that low hanging fruit. Yeah. It makes the most sense, you know? What? Wait, is this one not working at all? Oh, they're both CPUs. Wow, please, somebody. Oh my god. Oh, genius alert. Say, ah. Uh. <laughs> ah. Uh. <laughs> Get them guesses in for our next run, folks. Way to slow down the, the whole thing. What an idiot. Way to slow down everything. Alright, and the guesses stop as soon as I set this beer down, okay? Alright, ready, set, go! Let's go, let's go. Cool. There's already a new battery. I think, I think this is the same one. <laughs> 23 seconds! 23 seconds! <laughs> See that? 
That's it. Whoa! Look at that. That's disgusting. But your soul surprised <laughs> Can you help me fix this next console? Okay. Oh, good job, Grammy, you fixed it. That doesn't seem Fuck. I can't believe I just did that. I dropped my eyedropper thing in the alcohol. I think I need a new solder tip, dude. This is not working out like it should. I'm even adding flux and everything. Oh, ha <laughs> Wow! Just fucking shoot me in the head! Oh my god! This man should not exist! Whoa! Holy shit! Somebody please- Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm an embarrassment to life. I'm out of here. Wow. Today we are going to take this guitar and now we're going to see if we can restore it. I'm going to document the process of fixing a guitar that was totally smashed. Follow me on this journey. Hold it at a 45 degree angle for it to work. Okay. Well, it changed. Something happened. Oh shit, you're right. Okay. Oh, okay, I see. Okay. There it goes. Okay, thank you. I knew it. I knew it had to be something like that. Alright. Come on, man. Just put the disc back in there. Come on. Go back in. Okay, you're good. You're good. You're good. Holy crap. Ugh. I don't know if I'm 